Before we get started on today's video, there are two ways to support the Queen of Hearts channel. The first one is to subscribe, and the other is to donate to my Cash App. If this is your first time hearing about Cash App, and if you want to install it for yourself, then I will leave you two links. If you're using Android, then click the link that has the number one on it. If you're using an Apple device, then click the link that contains the number two on it. Also, if you're wondering about this icon, this will lead you to my blog site known as Queen of Hearts. It gives you some information and details that you may not have ever heard or seen of. Last but certainly not least, my cash tag name will be dollar sign Betty Boo 702. I repeat, that's dollar sign Betty Boo 702. And now, back to our regularly scheduled program. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Kingdom Hearts channel. Today I have some news about the Kingdom Hearts Tokyo Game Show 2022 merchandise. But before I give you the news, leave a like and subscribe, and make sure you turn on these notifications so you won't miss a single upload. So with that being said, let's just read the article. Uh, with the start of Tokyo Game Show 2022, uh, Square Enix has listed a great number of new Kingdom Hearts products to help condense the vast amount of news. We have complied these announcements into one article. Every item's Square Enix store links and images are below. That's what it says about, you know, if you want to click on it and stuff like that. So I'll just leave you the whole link of this article, but I'm still going to read it. But if you want to check out the store and stuff, um, you go to the link of this article, and then when you scroll down, you will see the link of the store. It's highlighted in blue, so you can't miss it. But right now, let's get back to the news. Uh, we will also be updating this article if more items and store links are shared. So right now, if I do hear or see anything that's been updated about merchandise or anything else, I'll have it for you right here only on the Queendom Hearts channel. But for now, we got some merch. So what we have here, this is absolutely beautiful. This made me want to get this clock. This is the Kingdom Hearts 20th Anniversary Melody Clock. I really love it. Look at, look how beautiful. It's, it kind of reminds me of the stained glass from every Kingdom Hearts game. Well, technically, um, like one, two, or three. <laughs> But this has like almost like a stained glass kind of feel, but it featured some art covers or sometimes artworks from the Kingdom Hearts franchise. And this clock made me want to get it. So, yeah, I, I really want this clock. However, <clears throat> however, you can get it on Square Enix Japan and or Square Enix uh, North American store. And the shipment will be at June 17th, 2023. Um, but for North America, September 2023. Uh, in Japan, it's going to cost you 16,280 yen, while in North America, $147.99. So yeah, it's definitely expensive, but I really wanted that clock. But it's going to take me a while for me to like get um, to like get this kind of money, but. That, that's all right, because I still have a long way to go before this item or this merch can be released. Next up, we have the Kingdom Hearts 20th Anniversary Mini Backpack. Um, it's only available right now in Japan because there's none from North America, but they'll keep you updated if there's anything about this uh, mini backpack. It, and I think the design is sort of like patterns of certain uh, shapes from the logos from Kingdom Hearts and stuff. Uh, it's going to cost you 14,080 yen. So it's going to be shipped, uh, the shipment will be at January 28, 2023, excuse me, which is going to be next year. 
Um, we, we also have the Kingdom Hearts 20th Anniversary Shoulder Pouch. And also, I'm not going to be doing the translation uh, trans uh, related to from yen to U.S. dollars for this one because I'll probably keep you updated if they manage to update anything from North American or North America, excuse me. <clears throat> I'm having a bit of issues. Um, I'm having issues of trying to talk properly, but I, I really need to get back on this news because I'm off track. Anyways, Kingdom Hearts 20th Anniversary Shoulder Pouch. And it looks like a pouch that you use for like for your credit cards, money, kind of kind of like a wallet, and also for your phone, which is pretty nice. Uh, nothing from North America, but in Square Enix Japan, it's going to cost you eight thousand five hundred twenty yen, and the shipment will be at January twenty eighth, two thousand twenty three, which is the same um, release date as the mini backpack. Next up, we have the flat pouch, which is very different. You can put certain stuff here, like your phone, your money, your cards. Um, it's only available right now from the Je from the Japanese Square Enix store. It's going to cost you 6,380 yen, and the shipment will be at January 28, 2023. <clears throat> Excuse me. Next up is the Kingdom Hearts 20th Anniversary Bum Bag, um, which is like, almost like a backpack, except that it's all um, like a crisscross kind of bag. It's very hard to describe it, but I take a closer look at this image right here, and apparently it's sort of like a, almost kind of like a pouch bag, but very, very different. <clears throat> It's only available from the Square Enix Japan store. It's going to cost you 10,450 yen, and the shipment will, will be at January 28, 2023. Next up, we have the Kingdom Hearts Sora Can Badge Collection Value 1, Box of 12. Now, this is sort of like a collection of badges that represents the character Sora, just Sora alone, um, and it looks pretty nice and, you know, pretty interesting. So we have Sora for KH1, we also have a, a, a certain types of KH2 Soras, except for the original one for some reason. Um, what we have is the Lion one, the um, Christmas Town one, <coughs> excuse me, we have the Tron version, then we have Sora in different forms. I, I forgot which one. I think this one is Valor form, and this one could be Wisdom form, and this, I don't know. And this one right here is the like the final form. And here's Sora uh, from uh, some sort of cutscene from page 3 where he is um, cooking with um, Remy. Um, and here's another... Um, this is not another KH3 Sora, but this is technically, in my opinion, Dream Drop Distance Sora. And this one is Sora from, um, from Sam Maishuo, because of the glasses. And we also have the, the Caribbean, Pirates of the Caribbean version of Sora. And we have Sora from like some sort of type of handheld game, which you, you can only play it in... In Kingdom Hearts 3, if, if my memory serves correctly, I do not know. But I think there's a time where you can play it in the mobile game of Union Cross. But, you know, it, it, with, everything's, um, with everything that's been closed down due to the finishing story, it's quite obvious that there's a possibility that the, the actual minigame will be available for KH3. I do not remember, but I think I do recall seeing it, uh, being able to play it on the KH3 game itself. But I'm going off on off track here. So right now, um, it's available not only in the Square Enix store of Japan, but also in North America. For Japan, it's going to cost you uh, about 6,600 yen. The shipment will be taking place at December 24th, 2022, which is going to be this year. However, in North America, it's going to cost you $72.
and the shipment will be taking place next year on February 2023. So make sure you write that down. Then we have another uh, Kingdom Hearts Sora Can Badge collection, and this one right here is Volume 2, which means there is still more. Technically, it means that there is uh, more that we have not seen yet. So, here we are. Remember when I said there's no cage to Sora? Well, I stand corrected. I stand corrected to myself. We do have Cage 2 Sora, but in some sort of drawing form. Halloween Town Sora, Merman Sora, um, uh, Timeless River Sora. Uh, then we have different forms of Sora, empty form of Sora. Then we have the younger Sora, which is really cute. <laughs> um, then we have Monster Sora, uh, the Toy Box Toy Story Sora, another Tron Sora from Dream Drop Distance, and of course, the, the trailer cutscene for Kingdom Hearts 4, it is KH4 Sora, which we haven't heard any news about the Kingdom Hearts uh, game. But, as usual, the pricings of the pricings and the shipments are the same as the first badges of the uh, Sora Cam badges collection. So, I'm not going to repeat it, but you already know how much it costs because it's a, it's a Cam badge and it it's the exact same price and exact same day of the shipment. Okay, moving forward, and I think, yeah, this is going to be the last one until I keep you updated for more. Um, this is the Kingdom Hearts 20th Anniversary Metallic Clear File. And I don't know what that does. But remember the new artwork of that Nomura was planning to showcase for the 20th anniversary. Well, this is the file, the clear file thing. I, I don't know what it does because I can't figure out what it is. But I'm going to have to zoom in just to take a look at it. It's only available from the Square Enix Japan store. It's going to cost you 660 yen. And the shipment will be taking place on December 24th, which is like in Christmas Eve. 2022. So, before we call this for today's video, let's go ahead and take a look at this clear file, the metallic, the metallic clear file, see what it looks like. Because I'm trying to figure out what it is. It, it doesn't look like a folder. I mean, if it is, I will be, you know, I don't remember if we ever have a Kingdom Hearts folder, you know. It's sort of like a, a school supply where you place certain pieces of paper and put it on a folder. I'm trying to figure out what this item is. I wanted to take a closer look at it just to see um, what it does or something. And here is the back of the um, metallic clear file. And... As of right now, I still sincerely do not know uh, what it is. What I do know is that more merchandise are coming, and it's just been super, super amazing. It, it, it really has, in my opinion. So, that is it for today's news, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry if there's no news about the game, but I will keep you updated if there's any news about that and about this whole merchandise update situation. But for now, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoy. And as always, stay safe, stay healthy, be kind to others, and more importantly, may your hearts be your guiding key.